Hello everybody, this is Mr. Future Zoologist, and today I'm here Hold on My peach face lovebird Simba. Say hi, Simba. Let's see if he'll go up my shoulder. All right, he'll stay there. Like I was saying, today I'm here to do a requested video by a new subscriber of mine, and his or her name is Snowball Snowball 525. So shout out to him or her. And also, you die one one zero zero. So shout out to those two people for subscribing to my channel, and hopefully I get many more. And this is a requested video by Snowball five hundred twenty five on a room tour of my room and just all the animals. And I'll be doing another video today. Um. So let's get started. First thing is my bed. It's like a WWE wrestling like layout because I like WWE. Then I have my curtain right here where the birds love to go on the top railing and perch. And then my window. A bookshelf right there where I keep the supplies. Simba just flew off. Um, a book shelf where I keep my supplies. Right up here. It, that's the lovebirds place set. Right? And then just movies and books. And a, a little stool. I have a laundry basket. My dashboard where I keep all my stuff. And a bunch of trophies. My door. There's Smokey running his ball. My closet where there's my shoes, my belt, and my clothes and all that. Up at the top I put some stuff. And the birds seem to like it. Down. My brother's bed, but he doesn't really go in here, so... There's no point of having that here. And then my big old TV stand, where I have a great view of the TV. My brother's clothes. And here's the parakeet cage, hamster cage, and the lovebird cage. And right here I keep my book bag. I have a trash can over there. So really, Snowball 525, I hope you weren't expecting anything big, because really my room, there's nothing big about it, except all my animals. Pretty much every single day I let them out, and they'll fly around, or the hamsters will run around, and it's fun to watch them. Um, let's see if there's anything else. I guess that's pretty much it. I I um did a tour of my room and if there's any um if you want a tour of the bird if the sorry if you want a tour of the hamster cage, the parakeet cage or the lovebird cage, just go on my channel and there's a video of the lovebird cage setup, the hamster cage setup, and there's one for parakeets. But to make this video a little bit more interesting, I'll go through their cage setups as of now because they are different. Let's see if I can get over there. Hold on. I'm coming. Oh, 
Also, while we're at it, let's do a pet haul. Because I bought, I recently bought, went to the pet store and I bought a couple stuff. For the hamsters, I got Carefresh. But this time, for the first time, I've gotten confetti. So it has a bunch of different colors in there. And also for the hamsters, I got that little green igloo in there. Which Smokey loves, but right now, um, Darwin is sleeping inside of there. Let's see if we can get a good look at that. I don't know if you can really see him, but he's inside there. Let's see if I can get him to come out. Darwin! I don't know if he'll come out. Well, let's continue with that. This little elbow tube right there. Their water is back there where you can do a little metal thing. Here's their two shelves, which has a wheel, um, a chew tunnel, and their sand bath. Up top is the petting zone with their food. Then they have others, oh, Darwin. Hi, Darwin. Alright, bye, Darwin. Oh. Um, their tube set up. There's an overhead look at it. They like that. Now moving on to the bird cage, parakeet cage, there's their food bowl, water bowl, they have a tree branch in the back to chew at and to climb on, a, a fake tree branch perch that they, they like, these two sandpaper perches, a little toy right here, another toy right up there, the cuddlebone holder back there, it's green, and their food container. Back there, a little bench. The white container is another food container. They have their rope perch, a new toy that they love. And then behind it, let's see if I can get to it, is their swing. Yeah, there's their swing. And then here's their play gym that they all love playing on. I've got their spray mullet holder, which is really just a perch. A bird bath. Spray mullet is up there with Simba and Nala. And just a bunch of toys to play on with on their tree branches. Now let's see if I can pick somebody up. See, they're quite tame. Sometimes they don't want to be tame and act crazy. Especially with the lovebirds, because I just got them maybe two weeks ago. And we're still struggling. Let's see. Let's see if I can pick him up quick. Come on, it's for the camera, Simba. There you go. You can go back, Simba. Got a cage set up for them. They have a little ring toy and a shaggy toy right there, followed by the sandpaper perch. That's a white, that's a water container, metal water bowl, spray millet bowl. They have a ladder back there. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a tree branch right here next to the water bowl. And there's a cuddlebone holder right there, it's blue. Another tree branch right there. There's their food bowl right there. Open up. You've got the chew toy right there in the entrance. A cuddlebone perch, a rope perch, an orbiter back there, and a swing. Right now, I can't get too far in there because my computer's charging and the wire can only go so long. Let's get out of the light. Alright, so that was a requested video of a room tour slash cage tour 
from Snowball525. Um, also, thanks to Yo Yudai1100 um, and CrabCare1. He was the first subscriber. Um, so hopefully, I get some more subscribers. Uh, comment on this video. Like the video. Subscribe to my channel. Um, and you can also request videos or ask me any questions about anything, really. Mainly about animals, but you can ask me really anything. And I'll answer it on my next video. And, yeah. Or also you can email me the question or the request um, at bballjw at yahoo.com. And thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, request, ask a question, and say goodbye, everybody.